I'm Victoria Velasquez Vincent representing my beloved Tavita. I am an architect and a heritage conservationist and aside from being a lover of all things visually creative, I'm also a lover of poetry and anything underrated. So whether it be the food that people typically don't like or the places less traveled, you will always find me going against the grain. I am a Virgo and the epitome of a Virgo at that which means I'm obsessed with being organized and solving problems and nurturing the growth of those around me. Fun fact, you will never find anyone with a better memory than me. Whether it's your birthday, your phone number, or what I had for Christmas lunch in 2012, you best believe I will never forget it. How would I describe my home province? Hmm, the same way I describe love. It feels like home and an adventure at the same time. Tada, Kavita Tayo. Wherever my brave Kavitanya heart takes me in our province, it's as if I'm walking through a history book where the pages are brought to life and I feel the power of my people. Through the battles they fought and the heritage structures they left behind. As a Kavitanya architect and heritage conservationist, there is no place I would rather be. Kavitanya culinary creations never fail to leave my mouth watering. Tara, kain tayo. My adventurous Kavatenya heart may lead me elsewhere, but no matter how far I go, I will always find my way back home. In honor of our glorious past, through the colorful and captivating nature of our present, Kavita, it's time to write the pages of the future with you. Ako si Victoria Velasquez Vincent. Ako ay isang proud Filipina mula sa lalawigan ng Cavite. How has the pandemic challenged you? Above all else, the pandemic has challenged me in a way that has made me both stronger and more independent. I spent the first year of the pandemic in New Zealand and had the privilege of having that safety and security. But I still chose to sacrifice all of those things and relocate to the Philippines in January. And if there's anything that that journey taught me, it's that you might need to make some sacrifices along the way and you might need to give up on so many things and let go of so many things in your life, but you should never let anything, not even a worldwide pandemic, get in the way of your dreams. Maraming salamat sa lahat ng suporta. Ingat po kayo at kita-kita.